My name is Joseph Kutz. I'm the Archbishop of Karachi. Karachi is the largest city of Pakistan. It is a port city situated in the south on the Arabian Sea. Karachi is also a big industrial city. It is the financial center of Pakistan. And in Pakistan, we or as Christians, we are a small minority and we do face many difficulties. But uh, what has been happening really in history is we see that uh, the difficulties are increasing. I just explain why I say that. Because in 1947, when Pakistan became an independent country, our founding father, the great leader as we call him, his name was Muhammad Ali Jinnah, he made a very beautiful speech where he said, you are all f are now free and you are equal citizens of this new country of Pakistan and we must all work together as Pakistanis. But things have changed since 1947. For example, in 1977, we had a military dictator and he ruled for 11 years up to 1998. And he brought in a trend to make Pakistan uh, uh, an Islamic state. Pakistan is a democratic country. The majority are Muslims, but we are a democracy, we have elected government. And he, uh, this military dictator, introduced some Islamic laws, which uh, has a big role in increasing discrimination or the way a Muslim perceives a Christian. And one of this is the, is the idea of Islam where a non-Muslim living in a Muslim country is considered a dhimmi. Dhimmi is an Arabic word. And it really, what it means in practice is you are not quite equal socially and politically with the Muslim majority. This is one thing that colors the attitude of Muslims towards Christians. And in the last two decades, with the war going on in Afghanistan, with increasing Islamic extremism and militancy, there's an increasing intolerance. We have experienced in the last few years, which was never before, the first terrible experience we had in 2001, when a church was attacked by two young men with uh, Kalashnikov assault rifles. They killed many Christians. Then it happened again in 2014. It happened in 2015. It happened last year on Easter Sunday when many Christians went into a park in the evening to celebrate Easter. Again, there was an attack by a suicide bomber. So there, has been, there is an increasing intolerance and uh, acceptability. It gives us the feeling as if to say that you are not wanted in an Islamic country. That is not the feeling of the majority. But this increasing uh, extremism which we are seeing all over the world with the growth of ISIS and the Taliban and Al-Qaeda. So that is where we are at the moment. We need to, and we are trying to assert ourselves as being real citizens of Pakistan, and not only just citizens, but citizens who are contributing to the welfare and development of the country.